others believe it to be a Bigfoot or even a dark man. Either way, to this day, hey, yo, dark the man. never been fully solved. I can go down the street and find like 20 different dark men. What the f is a dark man? I need to know the context of this urban thing because I could just, this, yeah. Are black people mythical beasts? Huh. I understand why they were captured. Hey guys, before the video continues, if you're new here or been here for a while, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the like button to help support me in future videos. Take it away, dude. Well, today is the day. I am introducing Sir Spooks. Ah, another scary channel. So now we have three currently in our reservoir. Satchel. Backpack. We have Bizarre. We have Nuke. And now we have Sir Spook. Slap Tam will be coming maybe soon. I don't know. There's something about Sir Spook's thumbnails drew me in more than Slap Tam. Even though Slap Tam does upload a little bit more frequently compared to Sir Spook. Uh, the last... This is the previous recent video of Sir Spooks because his most recent one of me of recording of today is top 66 videos of like scary stuff which is a two and a half hour video I, I ain't doing that we ain't doing that unless unless we do let's see 66 Unless we make it a six part video and we just do 11 stories each episode. I don't know why I had to go on the calculator and do that if I could have just easily just. So doing the math properly, not really properly, just doing roundups. For the 66 videos and then the two hours and 30 minute video, each story should take about two to three minutes if everything is like perfectly average meaning if i do 11 stories per video uh you're looking at between 22 to 33 minutes per video that seems fair so let me know if you want me to react to his most recent video and make it a six part series because two and a half hours on one whole video plus with me pausing for commentary making my comments that's gonna be like a four hour video that's no, that's too much. Even though TikTok will love it, it's be easy for me to upload stuff on TikTok. Still, I'm not going to sit through two and a half hours in one session. So I could probably just do 11 stories per episode and just release it in that kind of window. Part one, part two, part three, part four, whatever. Let me know what you guys think about that, because there's also a chance where there might be repeated stories. Or I might have to skip. So out of 66 videos, it may only be 57 that I react to. I'm just going to get into the video, which is 10 scary videos to keep you awake tonight. And this is by Sir Spooks, which is very close to 1 million. It's right around the corner. 919,000. Help him get there. Let's get it. Hello everyone, my name is Sir Spooks and today we'll take a look at 10 scary videos. But before we begin, make sure to subscribe for more scary videos. Oh, right. same. With that said, subscribe to me, to my YouTubes. This you know? Reddit video that was posted by user known as Squeaky Frog Toes is absolutely guaranteed to make you lose out on a few hours of sleep tonight. So okay. watch at your own risk. The person who posted the video claims that they've been noticing some seriously this, uh, strange activity in their house and anomaly. finally decided to set up a video camera somewhere hidden to record overnight and just throughout the day in general. While that inevitably recorded a ton of boring and useless footage, the uploader did actually manage to capture something genuinely eerie on camera that is sure to give you the chills. Sounds like my channel. 
The woman in the video can be seen sitting in the kitchen area of the house, simply just trying to open up a box of cereal to enjoy, when out of nowhere she hears this. That's, so that's either that's dust or... Oh yeah, that was a clear ass kid high. Her cat's right there to the right. Yeah, that was a clear. Hi. A strange childlike voice can be heard saying hi from somewhere nearby, causing the woman to flinch and be put on edge for the rest of the video. She then proceeds to stand up to survey the area, but is unable to find anything that could have caused it, Maybe even after she walks mm. around several parts of the house. In the description of the video, the woman writes that her security system also caught no movement or other activity except for her moving around for the box of cereal, as we just saw. She also points out that her dogs did not want to Wait, follow what her into the said? kitchen at all. We usually not access it from the chair, especially. Okay. Her moving around for the box of cereal as we the dog. Saw. She also points out that her dogs did not want to what follow her into the kitchen for her nighttime snack, which she points out as something that's quite unusual for her dogs. Could this mean that the dog sent something in the kitchen that they didn't like? Does the camera so have a speaker? A result, if it doesn't, then... To follow her. After all, anything's possible. Oh, I got nothing. If this camera does not have a speaker, I got nothing. Number nine. If you're a pet owner, then it's very likely that this next video posted to YouTube is going to make you a little bit scared of your beloved animal friend for the next little while. Okay. The video in question was posted to YouTube Shorts on August 11th, 2023 shorts? by a woman named Shorts Lauren getting some love now? At first, the video appears to be completely normal footage of a seemingly dark hallway. Sure, it might be a little eerie to see a dark hallway, but otherwise there's nothing creepy going on here. Then, we can see a black cat standing in the hallway. Initially, the cat is quite cute and lovable in nature, but then something proceeds to happen with the cat's face that then disappears oh. just a millisecond later. Be sure to keep a close eye on this footage and see if you notice anything unusual. <laughs> For some strange and unknown reason, the cat's face suddenly can be seen turning into that of a screaming person's face. To me, it almost resembles that of a screaming woman in particular. Of course, this begs the question, who in the world does this face belong to? Also, why did it appear on this seemingly innocent cat's face? Is this video evidence of a cat being possessed by a spirit? Could something else that's far less sinister be at play here? Either way, good luck wanting to go and cut your pet I think it's a face filter. A like this. I think it's a face filter that just... Number 8 A guy on TikTok named Tristan has been plunged into a terrifying experience as he struggles with the disturbing notion that his home might be host to an otherworldly entity. Okay. Tristan proceeded to set out to discover the truth about the strange happenings in his house. My homie got four fingers. Cameras in key locations. At first, the video footage simply shows the inside of Tristan's bedroom, with his door being slightly ajar. So far, so good. And However, mm. this seemingly innocent mm. and random video is about to be transformed into something seriously creepy. Mm -mm. Take a look. Whoever sees the door open, you're a villain. If you sleep with the door open at night, you are a super villain. You are a Avenger level threat. Oh, but you better get some WD-40. Oh, 
a orb shot at him. Or that's 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 no, those, those are dust bunnies. Um, you better get yourself a Molotov cocktail. Three minutes a press. So even the ghosts are like, bro, you fucking sleep with the door open? Let me let me get this shit for you. In the terrifying Never video, mind. Tristan recoils in terror from his bed as the door trembles with an unnatural force, sending shivers down his spine which is certainly an understandable reaction. No, he's a villain. He Watching just leaves the door like open. This, it's not hard to imagine how any skeptics could brush it aside, oh. since it certainly would be possible to fake. But that doesn't necessarily mean that this is a hoax. To this day, this video hasn't gotten any sort of concrete explanation given to it. So for now, we can only theorize as to what could possibly going on at Tristan's house. It certainly doesn't seem like anything good. Well, fucking villainous activity is happening in Tristan's house. If you truly feel comfortable enough to leave your door open, like just why just busting that pussy wide open and sleep, nah, you deserve to get haunted and touched inappropriately by a ghost. Why would you leave the door open? Stupid. Town. Round seven. A Reddit user known as Emerix posted this extremely strange video to the popular UFO subreddit oh, thought... with a video that has been perplexing nearly every person whose name is Hal. Hal Emerick. The video depicts a bright blue, nearly cloudless sky on a hot summer day and shows something that any skydiver would be absolutely terrified of. Otacon. A guy can be seen simply enjoying his day up in the sky mm -hmm. when out of nowhere, something can be seen trailing right behind him. You better get probed. Is that a... Is that... Reggie Alecki? It's like static. If you had the galaxy, I'm sorry, you could have seen what it is. But most likely it's either an out of date Android or a horrible, just garbage iPhone. Now, if you would have had the Galaxy, at least the 22, 23, 24, you could have course, zoomed in a hundred times and seen it. Was recorded very far away. It's difficult to tell exactly no excuse. what it is, no excuse. but a lot of people are theorizing that a UFO is flying behind him, which is definitely possible. Definitely possible? The uploader says that when he zoomed in on this strange object, he noticed an odd orbital looking activity around it. He also says that he initially thought it was just galaxy stabilization, but says that the bugs flying around in the video don't have that problem. He's using the galaxy and he's not using it properly. If you're trying to zoom in and record, what you just do is just a button and your uh, thingy or you screen record and it gives you three options. You can screen record with the mic audio, you can screen record with the phone's media audio, or you can record with the mic and media audio. Then what you do is you make your phone three by four and you just zoom in, not, not on videos, but on photos. You just go three by four and you just zoom in all the way to a hundred times. And guess what? You're fine. You would get what you want to get. If I could see the damn moon and the crevices and the craters, you could do the same thing. Honestly, you could do the same thing. I'm so sad that this was a galaxy person making us look bad. So that might not be the reason. There are a lot of good comments speculating about the video and what could be happening in it. One commenter points out that the object looks like an enlarged atom with the electrons orbiting at high speed. Regardless of whatever was spotted near the skydiver near that day, I think it's very safe to assume that this guy will probably think twice about going skydiving again 
for the foreseeable future. It's a Reggie Alecki, I'm telling you. Round six. Sydney, also known as Salt Sage, on TikTok, Australia? recently posted a spooky video to her account. In it, we see some truly strange things happening in her house while she was asleep and unaware of them. I'm in the clip, looking. Sydney analyzes footage that looks ordinary at first. Okay. It shows her kitchen in black and white with no action visible. But then the mood abruptly changes. Take a look. All of a sudden, okay. cabinet doors mysteriously fly open for no apparent reason. No drafts from open windows, for example. The abrupt movement is certainly quite weird and raises the possibility of paranormal powers at work and begs the issue of what could have caused it. I guess it's hard not true. to be left feeling uneasy when the video ends abruptly, wondering about the strange things that happened in this seemingly ordinary house. To That's this day, the only clip? The video remains a complete mystery. Let's mm. just hope that Sydney manages to get mm. to the bottom of this situation. Do you guys have any theories about what was going on here? If so, be sure to leave them in the comment section down below. I'm guessing the string theory. That's a theory I'm thinking. Just string and pop. I don't know. This... It definitely would have helped if we would have got more context clues of what's going on. More about Sydney, more about obviously the house. This is the first time this. We didn't get much information, so it's like it's kind of hard to draw any speculations or even thoughts if we don't get like a context, I guess. Yeah, that's just, just my thought. Round five. I don't know why, this next video doing was that. published to TikTok by user known as RJs and shows you exactly why you should be driving extra carefully when it's extremely dark out I and speed. there isn't much light around you. The video shows the uploader driving around in the middle of a dark and deserted road in the dead of night on August 6, 2021 at 4.40am. Three years, almost three years ago. Highway 897, just a few kilometers from Ryle Beach in Alberta, Canada. The uploader drives at his normal speed before he eventually proceeds to slow his vehicle down significantly as soon as he notices something incredibly odd off to the side of the road. Have a look. Someone please tell me they know this lady. It was August 6, 2021, 4.40 a.m. on a highway. Just a few kilometers from Rio Beach in Alberta, Canada. As you can see, a strange lady dressed entirely in white can be seen moseying around on the side of the road, much to the complete confusion and utter terror of the uploader. Okay. We have no idea what was going on or who this mysterious woman was. The uploader also stated that the woman was totally alone and even turned around to do a double take to make sure that he wasn't simply seeing things after being awake for so long. He also says that ever since this night, this woman has been in his mind constantly, and he can't seem to shake this incident. What in the world was this woman doing in the middle of a highway at nearly 5 in the morning? Also, why was she dressed all in white? Was she trying to do something? Was she lost? Is it possible that this woman is actually a spirit? It seems as if we will never truly get a proper answer. Three numbers. Nine. One. One. If you're so concerned about some random woman walking on the side of a highway in a white dress, 
nine one one or AK 47 teach her the second amendment I understand you're from Canada but let her know what the second amendment is if you have any concerns record it go on if you have access to Instagram live you know live stream it make your account public live stream it anything happens it's live Instagram can use that footage to figure things out easy for a case compared to you trying to record something happens phones disappears but it's gone live stream is live just saying just super saying round four a guy on reddit known as dependent at 695 posted a chilling video to the popular paranormal encounter subreddit which is a place for people to showcase authentic and truthful accounts of paranormal experiences and sightings the footage that the uploader posted was filmed by his uncle all the way back in the early 2000s which explains why the video looks and feels so retro what starts off six. as a seemingly normal video quickly transforms into something terrifying. The footage, filmed in the middle of a bright summer day, shows the uncle wandering around in the grass outside before he then proceeds to stop and zoom in on something a bit farther off in the distance. We got deeper about water droplets. Something's stalking him. Oh no, never mind. I thought it was 2006. There's two times going on. I guess the bottom is the real time, and then the top right is how long he's been recording. It becomes clear that there's definitely something lurking around in the grass with the man. But as for what exactly it is, nobody knows. And thus, the theories online have commenced. A lot of Ken people Walker? notice that the entity in question seems to have small, round, tan ears, which one commenter points out reminds him of a cougar, which would certainly be a less scary answer. Another person, however, thinks that the entity looks like a gigantic grasshopper. Others believe it to be a Bigfoot, or even a dark man. Either way, to this day, hey, yo, dark the man. never been fully solved, and we can only hope that'll change sometime in the near future. I can go down the street and find like 20 different dark men. What the fuck is a dark man? I need to know the context of this uh, urban thing because I could just this. Yeah, I can go down. I can go down the street where I live at right now and find 20 different dark men. Is that supposed to be like a, like a mythical beast? Are black people mythical beasts? Huh. I understand why they were captured. Uh, I did not say that. Yeah, I just heard it with your brain. I didn't see that. You said it. Round three. Imagine going onto your phone, checking your home security camera footage that was recorded overnight while you slept, only to be met with the terrifying sight of what looks to be something leaving your house. That's exactly the situation that a TikTok user named Miss Sandra 35 found herself in one night in early 2023. The video footage that was recorded on her ring oh. camera in the middle of the night shows something genuinely bizarre and baffling, making an exit from her front door in the middle of the night, much to her utter confusion and pure terror. Let's have a look. Take a midget and then here comes a uh Vic victorian dressed woman as you can see some kind of small white ghost or creature can be seen seemingly leaving her house the woman jokes that it almost looks like the popular kids ghost casper in the video which certainly lightens the mood but if this ghost wasn't creepy enough 
something else happens at around the 25 second mark in the video that is guaranteed to make you feel uneasy. Watch this. A Victorian dressed woman walks away from the house. Some kind of a dark figure in a dress can be seen very quickly moving into frame before the video ends abruptly just a couple of seconds later, meaning that we never get a closer look at it. To this day, the upload has absolutely no idea as to what was going on here, and it's unlikely that she ever will. Unless, mm -hmm. of course, somebody comments a theory that helps her crack the case. She lives in an old Victorian home. Round two. This video was posted to TikTok by a woman named Mandy in February of this Mandy. year. Mandy. shows something genuinely eerie that absolutely nobody would once have recorded on their home security camera system overnight. Okay. The video in question is security camera footage of the inside of her infant's room. As you can see, all appears to initially be going well, but things take a rapid change for the worse when this happens. Bro, Second Amendment, First Amendment, Third Amendment, Fifth Amendment, Fourth Amendment, all happening all at once. Nah, this motherfucker looking inside the house. Does the head get bigger? Fuck no. Well, he's. I you I am not nope. You got me all fucked up. Out of nowhere, a creepy face and hands can be seen appearing in the window, much to the horror of the uploader, who just wanted to have her youngster in a safe and caring environment. The video is even creepier when you zoom in on the window and get a better look at whatever was outside that night. Mandy also states that there is a child lock on the window, so there's absolutely no way that the window could be opened. Also, to make things even creepier, at one point in the video you can actually see the lights in the room randomly turn off, which Mandy says was not her doing. So it begs the question, what in the world was going on here? Mm -mm. This feels like a scene ripped straight out of a horror movie. Mm -hmm. Let's just hope that if her house is truly haunted or being targeted by someone or something, that Mandy moves her and her youngling out of there before it's too late. Yes. There is something called insurance fraud for your home. Burn that bitch down. I gave the instructions before in previous videos. Get yourself some single malt liquor or some or a bottle of vodka get yourself a rag and with that rag what you do you dip it in a little bit of lighter fluid so it can ignite a little bit more you know faster and you get one of these things right get one of these things and just you that's it you take this and put it against the thing Boom, it ignites, throw it in your house. After seeing that footage, I will personally never leave my kid alone. Never. There, the kid is going to be surgically attached to my hip until I say so. Fuck that. Round one. This video was published to the highly popular High Strangeness subreddit which is essentially one big collection of all sorts of photos, videos, and stories relating to the paranormal, UFOs, ancient cultures, cryptozoology, anomalies, and other strange things. Cryptozoology is this particular like video the currency? stated that the footage in question was filmed on a friend's trail camera 
on a ranch on a private property in the middle of the night in October of 2018. Although it's only a 7 second video, it's more than enough time to send shivers down your spine and will surely make you afraid to be watching this video alone if you are. Take a look. Oh yeah, I see this one. It's just a disformed dude. It's just a disformed dude. Out of nowhere, some kind of a strange, tall and lanky humanoid creature can be seen walking right by the camera before eventually disappearing out of view of the camera. Just seconds before the video abruptly ends, leaving us all to wonder what this trail camera footage ended up capturing. If you guys have any sort of theories relating to this video, be sure to leave them in the comment section down below, because I would love to hear them. And that was 10 scary videos. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, then subscribe. That was just a disform dude. You guys gotta understand that there's people in, in this world that exists, like Ricky Burick. He lives in the countryside. There are chances where people's mom is also their cousin and aunt. It's just how it is in the South. For some reason, they just are like that. Not common, but it's not really a surprise. It, it is the case that your mom and dad are cousins or aunts and uncles and your mom is also your sister type shit. It's not that surprising. A lot of the cases you hear about it is from the South. He's in the mountains. Most likely he's in the countryside. It could just be a person who's just badly disformed physically. And he's just taking a midnight stroll or morning stroll, some type of stroll. Could be skinwalker for those who believe in skinwalkers. My brain just leaned towards a disformed human being that is just walking. That's my thoughts. So spooks is not that bad. There's definitely quite a few stories I have never seen before. So I'm actually appreciative about that aspect. Let me know what you guys want. Do I continue doing Sir Spooks and do his two and a half hour video? Breaking out of six parts? Or do I just go into Slapped Ham and see his first video and then we make a decision of what to do? Let me know in the comment section. Another Sir Spooks video next video? Or Slapped Ham's video next video? Depending on what you guys say is what I'll do. I don't know. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, which was 10 scary videos to keep you awake tonight. We enjoyed it. Obviously, do the whole basic thing that YouTubers always ask. You leave a like, subscribe, whatever. I, I don't like saying it, but I have no choice to say it because you guys are not liking, which is not making my videos go on anybody's recommendations. And some of you guys who actually appreciate these videos are not getting it because you guys are not liking. So hit the like button. Help my videos get back in the algorithm. Until next time, guys, as always. Love your faces, and I'm out. Look, I'm coming from the next Peace. lane.